Today on Dad Hut, we're taking a look at the Corsair Gaming Lap Board. Is this the most comfortable way to work and play PC games? Let's find out. What's up everybody? Welcome back to Dad Hut. Today we are talking about a gaming lap board that you put right on your lap made by Corsair so that you can play PC games, you could do some work from your on your PC, all from the comfort of your couch. Let's get into it. And this is what we're talking about today. Here is the Corsair lap board. Uh, it's not too heavy. It's about five, five and a half pounds. Um, just perfect enough weight so that it's not flimsy and moving around on you, but not too heavy to where it's really, really weighing on your legs. And the back of it has got this like dense memory foam on here. So it makes it really, really comfortable for long sessions or just to have something on your lap for a long period of time. It's really not going to bother you at all. So you just saw it. What is it? What does it do? It's basically a board that sits on your lap. Um, and that you can have your PC hooked up to your television. You can do this in your living room or if you've got an office. You don't have to sit at that computer chair anymore all hunched over. Um, well, you know, I guess if you're hunching over, you're doing it wrong, but most people do. Um, and you can just sit in comfort and, you know, do your work or play your games from your couch. Kind of like you do with a console. You don't have to sit in a computer chair in front of a monitor. So uh, this is really going to be, for me, it's the comfortable way to play PC games. I could not play long sessions of PC games anymore just because I personally cannot sit at a computer chair for that long of time. It's just completely uncomfortable for me. And this fixes that. So again, this is made by Corsair and it is made specifically to be used with the K63 mechanical keyboard by, of course, Corsair. Now. Uh, you could use another keyboard if you could get one to fit in there. Um, I wouldn't recommend it as this is meant specifically for this keyboard. It, it matches it identically, even if it has the clips to clip it in. But uh, it is possible, I guess, that you could get just the board and maybe put your own keyboard in there. Uh, but I don't recommend it. I would say if you're going to get the board, get the the keyboard with it. I think it's a, a, a one and all deal. They do sell them separately. But uh, again, I wouldn't buy the board unless you planned on buying the keyboard, which is unfortunate because some people already have keyboards that they really, really like or that were really expensive. And just to go out and buy another one specifically to fit this board, I understand could be a little bit of a pain. But I do think it's worth it in the long run as they go together, they're meant to go together. And uh, I, I wouldn't want to try to, you know, finagle some other keyboard in there. Finagle, is that a word? So this is going to go completely wireless. Um, there isn't any wires that you need to hook up to the actual lap board itself. It is just a large plastic piece that the keyboard can snap into. And of course, the, the keyboard is wireless. Um, and you can connect through Bluetooth or you can connect through the USB dongle that is supplied for you, whatever you prefer. Um, it lights up blue. It's got uh, two different um, brightnesses. So you can do a light bright and a more darker uh, if it's really, really dark out. And, uh, or you could do no lights and that could save you some power and actually get you a longer running time to use the keyboard. And as far as battery life, it's been absolutely fine for me. I have never run out. Um, I think they say it can last up to like 72 hours if you have it on like the low power mode with no lights on. Um, for me, I just plug it in every once in a while. I've never come across a problem with it. Um, so again, it just it's just a micro USB that just plugs into the back charges it you know while you're not playing whatever you want to do but as long as you regularly charge it you should never run into a problem obviously you're going to need to add a wireless mouse with this if you want to go full wireless i use the razer naga pro but any any mouse will work as long as you're going to go wireless so this way you don't have to have any cords at all and you're free to just sit on your couch. So the keyboard itself is mechanical. Uh, it does have dedicated multimedia buttons, uh, which is really, really nice. Uh, the keyboard, you know, is, is a little loud. If you like mechanical keyboards, then you know what you're getting. So just know you're not gonna have a silent keyboard, which I guess to some people that, that could be a problem. So uh, just know it definitely does make some noise when you, when you use it. It is, it is a mechanical keyboard but it is a solidly built keyboard. It feels really good and I've got no issues with it. The mouse pad itself is a, a, like a stick on mouse pad. It is kind of just your regular small uh, mouse pad. So some people might have some uh, problems adjusting to the size of it. 
Um, it is replaceable, which is great. I mean, you can always just, you know, stick on something else um, as it wears down. Um, so keep that in mind. You might have to do some adjusting with, depending on how big of a mouse pad you use now, um, this is more of a standard size mouse pad, nothing large, nothing great. Um, and uh, yeah, so something to think about. So for me, this really changed the way I played PC games because I just kind of avoided them, I haven't really opened up my Steam account or anything in a while because I just don't want to sit at a computer chair and play games. This has changed that. I can sit on a couch, I can relax, um, and enjoy gaming. I don't have to worry about, uh, you know, I can only play for an hour because I know my back's going to start bothering me, my hands are going to start bothering me. Uh, maybe that's not the, the case for you, and that's fine. Uh, maybe this isn't meant for you then. If you're totally fine sitting at your computer desk uh, playing your games, I think you're better off that way. I think if you're gonna do some competitive gaming, I probably wouldn't do it with this lap board. I'd probably wanna sit at a desk uh, with you know your regular setup. But you know, for, for a large majority of us, we're, we're not doing anything super competitive. We're just playing games, relaxing, having fun. And to do that, sitting on the couch lounging out is a lot more comfortable than sitting at a computer chair in my opinion so what are the cons the cons really is that you kind of got to get both i mean you can't just buy just the keyboard you can't just buy the lap board they sell them in a combo and you can save a little bit of money um, but i would never buy the lap board without the keyboard I, I, to me it just it doesn't make sense um, there's a bunch of other options you, you could do if you're going to do that you could just buy a, a laptop you know thing that you sit on your lap or something um, and this is going to be much more sturdier than that by the way uh, I, I wouldn't even put those in the same category this is very very sturdy the keyboard does not go anywhere at all when you move it same thing with the mouse you have to tilt it quite a bit to get that mouse to start sliding um, so that's kind of where I am with it I think you know the negatives you got to get both uh, the other negative I will say is it's kind of large so you have to kind of figure where you're going to store this thing um, you know, it's not like a video game controller that you can just put down somewhere. You do have to have somewhere dedicated that you want to keep this. You know, my wife isn't going to let me keep it on the coffee table. Um, so, you know, you do have to lug it in and out every time you use it. It's super simple to hook up though. It's just one switch and you're ready to go, but something to think about. Oh, another minor thing is it seems to pick up dog hair quite easily. I only have one dog and you know, it's short haired, but still, uh, this thing seems to collect the hair. Nothing major, I mean, it's very easy to clean out, but uh, something to think about. So there you go, that's my review. I honestly think the Corsair lap board is, is perfect for somebody like me. Uh, it lets me play PC games again. Uh, if you are clicking on this video, then you probably are looking for a solution to sitting at a, at a desk and I feel you, I, I, I just couldn't do it anymore. And this will definitely, definitely do that for you. Uh, I highly recommend it if you uh, just wanna lounge on the couch and play PC games, you're not you know, gonna do something super, super competitive as long as you're keeping it chill. Uh, this is totally, totally doable and is very, very comfortable and I highly recommend it. If this video helped you out at all guys, please give it a thumbs up like, and subscribe so you never miss any of these Dad Hut videos, and we'll see you on the next one, guys.